Hey, what's going on guys? Pre-Raptor here. So, as we're coming really, really close to EVO 2019, which is on August 2nd and August 4th, as you guys know, I am really excited to see what kind of new content they're going to come up for in the Season 3. Either it's going to be Season 3 characters, DLC 3, or it's going to be a different mode in Tekken, like Tekken Force or anything, anything of that sort. So really excited to see what's that going to be about. So my final thoughts, my final thoughts on the predictions of Tekken 7 Season 3. Actually, let me think, sorry, I can't hear myself speaking as well. But yeah, on my final thoughts on Tekken 7 Season 3. Let's see, I made a video, a couple of videos on character predictions. Let's just go, let's just briefly go over all of them quite quickly. I'm not going to waste any of you guys time. It's going to be a really short video. As I said, it's a brief introduction or brief final thoughts on Tekken 7 Season 3 slash DLC. So, it was Big, uh, June, Unknown, Bruce, Safina, and Ogre. So out of these five characters, who has the hi highest likely chance of coming or making it in Season 3 or DLC 3? Let's talk about that. So, um, Anybody else want a piece? yeah, so it's gonna be, I'm, I'm gonna say, first off, the top three characters that, I, that are probably or might possibly make it in Tekken 7 Season 3 as they play a major role in that scenario because they, they, they play some, some more major role in that. So first off with Unknown, mother of Jin Kazama. So Unknown or June. So it's either going to be June or Unknown or June or an Unknown as her rage drive, right? So it's either going to be that because June plays a very, very major role in the Mishima or the Kazama line, bloodline. So we might see her coming back as well. Another unused uh, or rarely used character which had a little bit of small screen time in Tekken 7 uh, or in the Tekken series is Zafina. So Zafina was a really weird and unusual character. Guys, if you should check out my video on that. I will uh, put a card somewhere up there or somewhere like I should, it should, a link should pop up somewhere. Or just check my playlist down in the Tekken 7 HQ or headquarters which will give you all the information on which I did for the Tekken 7 prediction. So Zafina, a news character, played a major role in Tekken 6 uh, to defend against uh, Azazel. So she was the gatekeeper for Azazel. So people say she disappeared or she might she died along with the uh, temple when it collapsed, canon or not canon, but she came back in Tekken Tech 2, the dead don't die. The dead don't die, guys. So just remember that we might see her back and ogre as well so people have a lot of hate again uh, for ogre but if the character b is back in the tekken series no one can do anything about it because it uh, ultimately depends on harada or michael murray himself so themselves so yeah or it could be different characters it could be some uh, characters from the yakuza franchise as well uh, I, I don't i never played of the i never played any of the yakuza games but uh, it could be some someone from that franchise i it, Kiryu, I think his name is. I don't exactly know, but yeah, that's that's my prediction. So it could be, it could be anyone from any any fighting game series or any franchise for that matter. As they brought back Negan from the Walking Dead series, which no one thought it could be true, but it happened at last. Right? Oh, the video ended. Uh, but yeah, guys, that's that's all I got to say. So that th those are my final thoughts on season three predictions. Which is going to be coming out very soon. You guys have to look forward to EVO 2019. Stay If you guys don't watch the tournament, at least watch EVO. It's going to be fun. The tournaments are fun. The matches are hype as well. Only, uh, I only look forward to the Tekken series. I don't watch the other fighting games. I can if I want to, but I just like Tekken. So I'm a major huge fan of Tekken. So Tekken series, wait till the end on August 4th. Uh, and we will get an announcement from Harada or Michael Mori or both of them. So yeah, those are my final prediction. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below as well. Uh, if if it should be a different mode of Tekken, like Tekken Force, different characters, or it, if it should be uh, uh, different characters from different franchises. But you guys answer that. You guys you guys answer whenever you want to answer. You guys are the best. You keep on commenting, liking my videos. It's all I it's all I ask for you from you. And you guys do what you do. That being said, stay safe. Peace. Legends never die When the world is calling you Can you hear them scream?